Uh, we responded at about five minutes after four to a report of a uh, fire in the Roosevelt Drive area, uh, possibly a car crash. Uh, we responded with the Montana Air Patrol, uh, youth fire, uh, youth fire departments, both the, both the volunteers and the paid. Upon arrival up there, uh, we noticed a vehicle down in uh, about a hundred yards down in, into a, uh, a gully, about three quarters of the way up uh, Roosevelt Drive. Uh, officers went down and investigated it. Uh, once the fire was put out, we were able to get down and, and look at the vehicle. We did, did, did determine at that time there was a was one uh, uh, deceased person in the vehicle. Uh, the high patrol took uh, over the crash scene. Uh, we assisted the fire department in. Uh, with the fire and uh, uh, extricating the, uh, the uh, victim out of the vehicle and then uh, getting the victim uh, taken to the crime lab. Did you, uh, just the circumstances of the crash, how do you guys suspect this went down? How would you? We believe the, uh, the vehicle is traveling uh, north to south, uh, down Roosevelt Drive basically. Uh, toward Butte. Toward Butte. Uh, the vehicle then left the roadway, we believe at high speed. Uh, Landed in the gully, uh, rolled uh, several times down an embankment, and uh, caught fire. Why did it catch on fire? Well, I suppose because of sparks and gas yes. are involved. Um, but you know, it, it was a very intense fire. When we got there, it was, it was burning intently. Uh, the uh, uh, fire department was able to get it out without any, uh, you know, without any other things catching on fire. But it was a very hot fire. Uh, we were unable to identify the vehicle by VIN number and everything, everything had melted off the vehicle. Fire was put out, so uh, we're still working on getting a uh, searching for VIN numbers on the vehicle and uh, uh, positively identifying the vehicle and the owner. Any factors in the crash? Any the idea of how this could have occurred going very fast? There was speed, speed, and, and, and it's a very curvy road, and, and there was uh, uh, speed was involved. Just went right off that, yeah. So, um, what are, what are you guys? What is the police? Your the process now is that, uh, like I said, the uh, body uh, was taken to the crime lab last night. Uh, we also have some DNA samples that we're bringing down, the, that we have at the crime lab, we're bringing down to the crime lab, and we should get results from the DNA test in about a week to uh, positively ident uh, identify the body. Are you investigating the car, or is that the highway? High patrols are investigating the crash, and we're assisting on, an, uh, on other matters of, uh, with the vehicle and with the uh, ident positive identification of the body. What kind of vehicle? It was a Chevy truck, a, s a single cab, uh, half ton Chevy truck. Pick up. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you picked up? Uh, no, you guys have the names? Yep, we do. Okay. Thank you.